Hey guys, Stuart here. Welcome along to this channel. I hope you're all having a productive day. Now today I'm going to share a quick way that you can simply remove the backgrounds from your product images in just a few minutes using Canva's background remover. Okay, so before we go ahead and launch into this brief tutorial, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already or if you're new to this channel and that way you'll stay updated with actionable videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills, knowledge and tools to help your small business thrive online. And with that quick note out of the way, let's go ahead and remove the backgrounds from your images in just a few simple steps with Canva. <music> Okay, so to leverage Canva's background remover, you do need to have Canva Pro, which is a paid plan. However, you can access Canva Pro for 30 days completely for free and you can cancel at any time. So what you want to do is either head over to canva.com and sign up for Canva Pro or feel free to click the link in our description below this video and that's also going to allow you to sign up for Canva Pro for free for 30 days. So take your time to sign up with Canva. And for those that already have a Canva account, what we'll do is meet you inside Canva. Okay, so as you can see, here I am inside my Canva Pro account. Now, if you're completely new to Canva, what I suggest you do is watch our complete beginners tutorial, which I'll link up above and down below in the description. That will help you get started with all of Canva's amazing features and tools. So go ahead and check that out if you're completely new to Canva. Now, what we can do is navigate up to the search bar and we can search for any kind of design that we want to create from social media posts, whiteboards, presentations, PowerPoints, Facebook posts, YouTube banners, and even videos and websites. However, for the purpose of today's tutorial, I'm just going to navigate down and click on Instagram post. And I can choose from these pre-made templates or I can go ahead and create a blank Instagram post. I'm going to select blank Instagram post because I want to add my own image and I want to remove the background from that image. Then we can navigate over to uploads and we can upload our product image. And here's the product image that I want to remove the background of. Then all I need to do is click on this image and drag and drop that image into this design interface. Now we want to remove the background of this image by simply clicking on the image and then navigating up to edit image and then come down and click on BG remover or background remover over here. Remember you do need Canva Pro in order to access this feature. Give Canva a moment to remove the background and as you can see, Canva has done a great job at automatically removing the background of this image. Now, what we can also do is navigate up to select a brush and we can choose to erase specific elements on our image or restore specific elements on our image once we've used the background remover. For example, what I can do is navigate down to the bottom and I can zoom in and then I can navigate over to erase or restore. So if I go ahead and click on erase, I can erase different elements if I like. I can change the brush size. So I'm going to select 10. And then, for example, I can go ahead and remove this corner if I like. I don't know why I'd want to do that, but just in case there's a few little elements that you've missed, you can go ahead and manually erase them or restore specific elements on your image. So I'm going to go ahead and click Cancel, and then click Apply, and then come down and zoom out. So as you can see, we now have an image with a removed background. We could also navigate down to background and add a different background to our image if we like. And then when you're ready to download your image, what you would do is navigate up to share, come down and click on download, and then make sure that you have PNG selected, then click on transparent background, and then simply click download. And that's going to download this image with a transparent background. And it's as simple as that. So I'm going to go ahead and try one more design by clicking add page. And this time I'm going to navigate over to photos and then type in shoes. And I'm going to come down and select this pair of shoes here. And then let's try the background remover on this image. Edit image and then background remover. Give Canva a moment. And just like that, we've removed the background of that image. And now we just have the shoes in place. I'm going to navigate over to background and I'm going to come over and click on this background image here. And then what I could do is click on the background 
and then navigate up to edit image and I'm going to come down and click on see all and then I'm going to blur the background just slightly and I like the look of that. And then you can play around with other different elements that you want to add to your image. It's as simple as that to remove the background from your product images or other image types. And that is it for this brief Canva tutorial. Now, if you have any questions about this tutorial, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this tutorial all the way through to the end. If you got value, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to this channel. And that way, I'll see you in the next video. Take care, guys.